Okay, what's up guys? Welcome back to part 5 of my first time playthrough of Stray. As always, Jaiko here. And uh, we're just going to start right where we left off. Uh, well, that was easy because I um, kind of did an auto save. So I took some time to like move my files over and all that stuff. Anyhow, without further ado, let's start kicking this cage down. Alright, I can rock it. Left and right. Left and right. Okay, I was going to say gently, but this does not look gently at all. Ow! Oh, nice. That was easy. What a flimsy-ass cage. You gotta buy some uh, higher quality shit around here. Oh, one of them is dropped down. Oh, that's screw me. Okay, uh, let's head over here. Okay, well, these cages and prison, I suppose. Oh, it is cat proof because I can't walk through it. Um, climb up maybe. Yeah, up is the right answer. And I is that a little too far away for me? Uh, is that too tall? Am I not clipping at the right angle? <clears throat> okay, so I don't think... Oh, wait, I see something. Do I get to do it again? Or I'm here. Anything else for me to look at? That? No, oh, wait, maybe? No, definitely not it. Okay, it has to be that stick up there, but how do I get up there? The fuck? What? Okay, okay, whatever. I'm just gonna let that go. <laughs> the, the the precise angle that you need your camera to be in or their cat to be facing to um do all these some of these jumps are like goddamn man. You gotta be like super precise. Okay, we walk jail. Yep. Okay, that seems to be a fitting uh, title for this chapter. Okay, so I can move this cage, which is what I did already. Um, get down this way. I cannot activate this. Okay, let's activate the other side of the stick. Okay, but what does this do? I guess down the barrel? Yep. Okay, barrel, barrel. Oh! Gotcha! Nice. Do I have security cameras? Left, right. Auto save. Nice. Uh. Oh no! He's being tortured! How do I save him? How do I save him? Can I not? Okay, I, I, it has to be this solution, right? There's someone here. Oh no! I just realized B12 is not on my back anymore. I have to save B12 as well. Okay, so how do I save that poor robot? Can I even save that poor robot? I don't think so, right? Do so I hit down here? Can I really not save that poor robot? That's kind of gloomy. Whoa, I got super fuck me in this freaking a-hole. This is like some Metal Gear Solid shit right here. Okay. What about this room? Anything in this room? Oh, so bright. Oh no! 
poor um robot. He probably drank poison or something. Okay, so we're gonna. Oh, motherfucker! Okay, we're gonna do the same trick again. Yep. Cool. Later. What about this? Can I go in? I can't go in any of these doors. Alright, so I guess in conclusion, we can't go into any of these jail cells. I guess we'll just have to, um... Oh! Yes! Is that Clem? I can't tell. They all look the same to me. No, uh... No offense. Oh, okay. Got it. Oh, right, because I don't have B12 to translate for me anymore. Um... These are... Yep, there's a net and a... Glass there, I guess. Okay, walk through here. What do we got here? Oh, shit. I probably made a lot of noise. Why? What, are, what is the wrong of their obsession with, like... Oh, I guess the robots are obsessed with the outside. In one way or form, is that what it means? Alright, so we are back out in the prison. Whoa, these are some very, very giant prison. Why do you need such a large place for a prison? There's like not even that many robots out there. Um, okay. Knock this fucking cup off, why not? Grab the key, okay, we're good. Can I open this door? I'm guessing no. Oh. Yeah, I'm guessing no. So I'm just gonna go here. Hey. Pass it over to Clem. Clem. I don't know what you're saying, Clem. I, I don't have B12 with me right now. And we gotta save the doctor. Wait, what do I do? Is there anything here for C? No? Okay, okay. Alright, let's go find the dock. I hope we're finding the dock, right? Uh, this is a dead end. Okay, nope, not wrong way. Okay, Clem got the right idea. Go this way. Do I go in down here? Nope, guess not. Alright, left, right, clear. Uh, this door cannot be accessed. This door cannot be accessed. Uh, which way are we going, Clem? Okay, nice. Cinematics. Okay, come on! I'm pumped. I'm ready to get... I'm ready to save the dock and get the fuck out of here. Oh no, what's this? No, that is the dock! We have to save him! Clem! Yes, that's right, Kitty. Call him. We gotta save... Or her. Sorry, I, I don't know anymore. I'm guessing Clem is a girl name, but, you know. Oh, is Clem actually gonna help us? Oh, okay, okay, good, good. Clem is... So Clem is not a pussy. Thank God. Because I'm supposed to be the biggest pussy here. Or cutest pussy. Alright, let's go. We can do this. I can't run. I have to walk. Like, this is like a cinematic moment. Alright, what is this? Okay, okay. That's fine. Drones are fine. We've met, we, we've uh, dealt with them before. Okay, yep, gotcha. Uh, okay, I cannot activate anything because, um, I don't have B12 with me. The Doc. I guess I should just call him Doctor. Because Doc is already another character's name. Alright, so, um, exit out here. We are Gucci, I think? Um. 
The parcels, maybe? Okay, okay, nice, nice. There we go. I didn't see these, uh... Okay, cool. Ah, oh, kitty cat, you're so brave. I'm so proud of you. Alright, so... Okay, drone with a moving laser. Okay, that's fine. There's a window opening on the right side. We can we can go for it. Okay, yep. I believe there was a drone here earlier as well. Okay, anything up here? Oh, security camera is dead. Okay, that's good news. But how do I hop over these ones? Hmm. Oh. Okay, there's a... Oh, keys? No, those aren't keys. Those are padlocks. Oh, okay, I get it, I get it, okay. And then I get out. Fuck! Does that work? Oh, it works! <laughs> Fucking idiotic algorithm. Get fucked. Alright, so... Alright, so what should I do about this? I should just... I should just hightail it, right? Like, I shouldn't be, like, lingering around. Yeah, let's do that. Hightail it. Oh, shit! Okay. Oh shit, that scared me. I thought I didn't make it. Okay, let's hide in this box for shits and giggles in case. Okay, okay, yep. Patrolling sentinel, uh, patrolling dro drone. That's fine. Okay, get up, get up, get up. High tail it, high tail it. Go, go, go. Okay, where are we now? We are... Okay. I don't know what that does. Oh, turn it off, nice. Okay, now what? All the drone's attention's on him. Do I just... Get the fuck out of here! Oh shit! Okay, that was a bad call. I thought I could just jump up and then... Damn it! Okay. Now we know. Now we know. But I think for a first one, that was pretty good. Oh, you motherfucker. I have to start all the way back here? Oh, that is brutal. Actually, it's not that brutal. I mean, let's be honest. I played Elden Ring. But that, that shit is like... It's like... Fucking put salt on your rune. It's like it's not good enough that the game beat you down. They have to like rub fucking salt and vinegar all over your fucking body. Okay. Cool. I tail this. Yep. Oh, there you go. There you go. I think that wasn't too bad. I'm a gamer. Fuck yeah! Alright. Can't skip this cutscene, but that's okay. Now they're on super high alert, but that's fine too. Um, over here, over here, we're gonna go here, up here, to pick this shit up. Okay, we're good. We got it, we got it, we got it. Doctor, are you okay? He's low bat. No! Oh, he just magically transforms into his backpack. 
I felt like I was trapped in my lab's computer system again, all alone. But you came back for me. I can't believe it. You're a good friend. I'm so glad we're not we're all together again, but we're not safe yet. We need to find a way out of here. You can open that door. Just can you open that door just there? Damn it, I, I, I'm so shitty at reading sometimes. Alright, cool. We got it, we got it. Okay, left, right. I feel we're clear. I'm gonna double check here in the back. Make sure no drones. Okay, we're good. Now what? Now what, Clem? Uh, do I have to do something? I'm sure I have to do something. So, okay, sure. Do we just bash the door? Oh, I think we are just going to bash the door. Oh. That is not loud at all. Cool, now boost me up. Okay, now what? Open the gate, yep. Okay, okay, we got it, we got it. Alright, Clem. Uh, those sentinels are blocking the way again. They will spot me instantly. Maybe you can try bait them into those cells and lock them in? Okay. Bait them into a cell and lock them in. Oh, what's this guy doing here? Do you see that guy on the ground over there? He was rebooted. I don't want to lose my memory. I'm so scared. Alright, so. How do we bait them into... Was this guy the one? Oh, this guy's the one that was rebooted. The recovery center has done me the greatest good. My mind is clear and lucid. I'm extemporary citizen now. Ugh. Okay, so this is the gate that I'm supposed to bait them in. Which is fine. How many I have been dealing with? One? Yeah, just one, right? I don't think it's that bad. Hey, bud. Come here. Hey. Done. Locked. There you go. Bye bye. Now, let's get thumbs out. Yep, thumbs out. All right. Clem, let's go. Tall ass! You know, I can totally just push that door as a cat. Like, let's be real here. Oh, memory! This poor fellow. It seems that the sentinels are ruthless when it comes to uh, defying them. That's what I feared. They have completely erased them. No more emotions, no more self-awareness, no more memories. Please, let's not get caught. Oh wow, I missed like four blocks of memory in between. I, I bet you it, it's it's that section. It must have been the um, Midtown, right? I feel. Ah, oh, well, I guess. That's it, I'm not gonna get a completionist award or or uh, achievement, I guess. Hey, don't get me in trouble. I only have 758 years left and I'm and then I'm free again. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm guessing there's a door there. Okay, let's um let's fuck these guys up. Yo, buddy. This one got out. Fuck! Oh, 
Did I get both? I think I did. Yep. Got him. Got them both. Let's, cut. Let's catch this guy. What do you got? Ah, ha ha ha, wow, what you did, ha ha, that was so funny. I think he, uh, he's a little, uh, his system's a little cuckoo right now. Oh, what's going on? Are they starting to come alive? Well done, locking up that sentinel. We gotta take the power back. Oh, they're being rallied. Yes. Let's start a rebellion. Would you like me to give you a pan flip? <laughs> Alright, so... Uh, Clem is already in, I believe. Can I meet this guy? I don't think I talked to this guy. Pablo, yeah. These sent don't deserve it. I want them to know what it feels like to be jailed. Okay. Okay, Clem. Let's all uh, get out of here. Boost me up, maybe, perhaps? Stay alert, we aren't in the clear yet. Okay, what do I need to stay alert from or for? Oh, okay, I'm supposed to do something, okay. Do I... Oh, here. Are we getting out to the outside? Is this it? This door! It's the only way out of this jail. I think we can open it from that control room over there. We have to find a way to get access to that room though. Let's look around. I have a question. We started a rebellion of those three robots. Why aren't they coming with us? Like they could have been much help right now. Well, I guess it won't be much help if it's for stealthing, but you get my point, right? Like, it will work. We're in luck. They left the keys in the door. Hop in the back of the truck. We should be able to jump over the fence to access the secure area. Wait, what? What was the plan again? Sure, Clam. Got it. Wait, is it because this office is locked like we cannot get in oh yeah, yeah it absolutely is yes. skated all right so back to clem's plan which is here okay yeah what they do oh i see Here, right, nothing, left, okay. Uh, open the thing. Bruh. Oh no! What do we do now? Oh shit, 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 shooting me, shooting me! Ah, wait for me, you fucker! Ah, Clam, slow down! There we go. Oh, yes! GTFO! There's no way I'll we'll make it with the sentinels on our tail. I can distract them for a little while, but you have to go. The outside manifesto says we must go outside at any cost. I wrote that. Wow, Clem, that's 
quite honorable. You're one of us now. It's not that everyone has to go get to the outside, but one of us has to. Oh wow, Clem. Now go! I'll keep you in my ram, little outsider. Aw, oh, that is... Damn, Clem. Wow, Clem. That is unexpected. When she closed the gate, I thought she's gonna backstab us. But, wow, I guess I was wrong to judge, huh? Oh no, what happened to the, to the poet? At least I think this is the poet. Okay, yeah, okay, the poet's gone. But I'm guessing, okay, we got the tram going. I'm gonna guess the poet's here. Like, he's gonna show up like right on this corner or something. I don't think I see him or anyone on this train. All right, so in that case, let's uh, start this tram. What? How do I start the tram? Do I start from the outside? Like here, on these lights? How do I start you? Okay, unless this is... No, no, there's no way. I, I don't plug the keys in here. It's definitely... Here. Right? This was rather bizarre. I still have the key in my inventory, right? I have a battery. Oh, the battery! Okay, um, what do I do, BB? Fuck. Oh, we finally found the atomic battery. It looks really powerful, doesn't it? Oh, it looks powerful, but... You know... This key looks like it can start the subway car. Okay, so I gotta do two things. I got the power... So I must shove it in here somewhere, right? So is it the back? Right, do not open? How do I open then? Okay, okay, no, no, I don't want to examine it. I want to, I want to examine it. Okay, sure. Okay. Uh, examine. Okay, everything is as, ex as expected. But... What do I have to do? It's not going to be down here, is it? I don't think so. Uh, nope. This seems to be... Oh! Yes, it is down here. Necro Corp. Hallelujah, it works. All right. Wait, now we're talking. Okay, let's just GTFO. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, the cat somehow turned the keys. Don't know how that happened. That's probably why it was done off screen. And to infinity and beyond. In cat speed. Or cat perspective, I should say. This looks like a final showdown. Control room? This definitely looks like a final showdown of some sorts. Okay, okay, we're at the station. We're at the next station. You are 
are now at Grand Central. Oh no, Walled City 99. Oh. Hello, how may I help you? Wait, what? There's more people living at this next station and it looks so much cleaner? Well, I guess that guy was cleaning it up, but you know. Okay, this is interesting. Wow, Walt City 99, it actually looks functional and clean and it's working-ish. Greetings, inhabitant of Wall City 99. Okay. This is getting eerily weird now. I'm currently painting this area. Please be careful of the wet paint. Have a nice day. Oh, I think I just got my feet wet, but that's okay. City Seal. Okay. Greetings, inhabitant of Wall City 99. This door leading to the surface is currently locked due to the confinement procedure. Please refer to any certificate certified engineer out inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. Okay. Okay, so we're still walled in. I think they all pretty much give me the same dialogue, so I'm just gonna uh, proceed. Wait. Why is he painting? Oh, he's washing the windows, but... Is this the control room? Hello, my current task is clean the windows. Please refer to my certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. Okay. Okay, control room's here. Inspect. Packed. Done. Open. The control room is closed by some sort of security protocol. It says that only humans are authorized to enter. It also says I'm not considered human. Hey, that's offensive. Security protocol. Maybe we work together. We can open this passage. Okay, how do we find a human though? Washroom? Like, do I go into the washroom and find a human? The city has been sealed off for your safety. Please refer to certify. Okay, yeah, same thing. Okay, how do I find a human or become a human? There must be a way around here, right? Um. this I can't press it though it's like grayed out oh fire hydrant okay none of these are working Oh, okay, okay, okay. There we go. We hacked it. We... I still can't open it, though. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We got this. Alright, come with me, Roomba. Come on, Roomba. We don't got all day. Chop, chop. Okay? Told you to lose some weight. There you go. Pack this. Scratch this shit! Fuck you! There you go. Now 
Now, the biggest mystery of all is our humans. This is the control room for the entire city. They control everything from here and it's empty. Yeah, no shit, people are GTFO. I remember hating them so much. They had everything, clean space, limitless power, freedom to move, little good it did them. The plague, I remember now. Everyone was dying and they thought they could they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. But I can still help you. We can still go outside. Together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I love. Alright, so a plague came in. Wiped out all the, I guess, supposedly lower tier people. And all the rich people, or the more nerdy ones I guess in this case didn't do anything to help they kind of just live in isolation I think I'm getting this um the story straight here in this world uh, oh also and because to combat all the garbage and junk they make because they didn't change their lifestyle at all they created some bacteria the Zerks which like after 6 billion years uh, became some crazy ass isopod that eats everything. Okay, not everything, I guess, but like it eats robots and kitties, apparently. Alright, what we got here? This is it, the main computer. According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. The whole city has struck in a lockdown cycles from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. We'll need to bring the rest of these systems online. These computers hold the data we need. We need to turn them off. While you do that, I'll look for passwords and encrypted keys to get into the system. Okay. I wonder if we can trust Doc. I know this sounds weird. But I wonder if we can trust Doc. I wonder if he's one of those humans that that just wants to control the world, you know? Because, you know, he still has human tendency, you know? I think we're good. These long rows of computers- Oh, it needs to be turned on! Fuck me, I did the wrong way. Alright... We'll do one fell swoop on three of these tables. Hell yeah! Oh shit. There we go. Ta-da! It worked! Good job, my friend. I found it. I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Wait, maybe there's a way around it. Roof control station. Locked. Of course. There, that's the workstation to open the city. But there are several layers of security preventing us from using it. We need to do what we do best. Me, I'll hack some machines and you destroy some stuff. Wait, what? What do I need to destroy? Like this? Scratch this shit up. Okay. Is there another one back here? Looks like it. Nice, there you go. Scratch this shit up. 
this is done. We probably have one more. Here? No, no, not here. Oh, is that it? This one we destroyed already, didn't we? Where's the third one that we gotta destroy? Or actually, maybe we only need to do two. I only said three because there's three locks on it, right? All right, let's try. Let's try doing something about it. Okay, maybe we still have to destroy some more shit. Okay. Where are the other shit that to destroy? Here? Doesn't look like it. Oh. Oh no! Doctor! The, the, the system is taking more than I expected. Intrusion alert! Intrusion alert! Intrusion alert! Intrusion alert! Oh no, our descent- Oh no! We gotta- We got to keep going! Okay, but... What do we gotta keep going with? Okay, okay, so we got one locked down. Now what? Oh, here, 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 the other one. Hack! Go, go, go! Oh no! Don't worry, I can recharge once we open up the workstation. Alright, alright, doctor. You, you gotta... You, you, you. Don't... Don't die on me before we go out. I mean, Clem and everyone is already like... Didn't make it. Alright, so... Um... We need one more hacking? Is it here? Oh, there. How does one hack this? Okay, the, the power is here. Oh, there we go. Yep, there we go. And this can be hacked. Oh no! It's like... I think that you think this body is a little done for. It's okay, I'll be alright. Just carry me to the workstation and we can disable that alarm. Oh, this is like pretty sad. It's like he knew he was gonna get fucked and he's still doing it for us. Or I guess for. I guess, you know, what are humanities left, I suppose. That's it. We're safe. Listen. I have something to tell you. I knew the power required to disable the city control system would be immense. More than this drone body can handle. But with the security now disabled, I can take control of the system and open the city. Overriding would destroy my software. But I made the choice that I hooked into that first computer and the consequences it could bring. Oh no. Ah, uh, don't do this to me, doctor. I'm sorry, we won't see the outside together. I thought I needed to carry on the memories of humanity to hold on to the past. But I see a future in the companions and you. Here, let me take that off of you. You're my friend, the very best I could have asked for. Thank you. Oh, god damn it, Doc. Why are you doing this to me? No, Doc! Oh, I should have taken a picture earlier than this. Like, the one where he was, like, snuffling her head against it. Please wait. 
Wait, so what's going on? Did Doc fuck it up? Oh, he's opening it. Yes. Oh, what I mean is like, did he fuck up the entire city? So then like people can get out. Oh, the Zerks! Are they gonna be killed by sunlight? Yes, they are! Oh, that is like... Yes! Although, should I feel bad about the Zerks? Who knows? Momo! Oh yeah, I think that's Momo. I think that's Doc. Oh no, that's Guardian. Oh, too bad this isn't full screen, the cinematics. I forgot who that is. Clem! Oh, Clem. That's Clem. Yes. Oh! He opened it for everyone! Oh, that's such a beautiful scene, dude. Do I exit? Oh. My, uh, care- my, my, uh, controller vibrating, telling me that I can GTFO now. Oh my god, it's so cool! And it's actually opening, like... Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. 45%? I think we can get out now, right? Oh no, kitty! Can I talk to these peeps? Oh, actually, can I talk to this guy? Oh, he doesn't talk to me anymore. I can just get out. The world's safest city, Wall City 99. Oh, so this is like a bunker, like a fallout bunker. Oh, I'm back on the outside. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture of this. This looks nice. That's a nice, uh... This is a very beautiful game. Oh, that is pretty good! That's pretty good. Um, no, okay, so as always, um, I'm gonna spend a little bit of the time here as we roll out the credits, just talk a little bit about my, uh, you know, I guess thoughts on this game. Um, I absolutely loved it, right? I think everything about this game was, um, how should I say it? it it's very well crafted. I think that's the best way to put it. Like, I, I, I like the fact that, like, the atmosphere, the art style like yeah i know it's not like your i don't know like red dead redemption or grand theft auto is everything is not like super realistic or anything like that but i think for what the developers did which is the whole purpose of making it like you know futuristic it was not supposed to be blinged out graphics the how how they pieced everything together it was pretty darn good right like i really do feel like you know there's some sort of like a you know gloominess to the city you know, like, it really does make me feel like, you know, putting myself into their shoes. So for a, I guess for a narrative driven, intera a narrative and interactive driven experience, I think this is pretty darn good. I think this is it, right? It's not, it's not like, um, you know, let's say a graphics novel, which is like, oh, you read all the feelings of a person, go through all the dialogues and all that stuff. Like this one makes you really walk around in the environment and tell a story through your own feelings, right? I think this is, they nailed it. They nailed it really, really freaking well. Uh, I also like the fact that this game, there's no, 
how should I say it? It's like a miniature version of a triple A game, right? Like, so for example, they have a little bit of stealth, right? They have a little bit of like combat, I suppose. Like we know when we get the gun and we can blast fucking Zerk's uh, face off. Uh, there's a bit of combat, I would call that. Uh, there's a little bit of adventure gaming, right? Like, you know, when you're in the first city, uh, which I forgot what the name is now, but when you met the guardian and everything, um, you actually go around the city, you know, collecting items, talking to people, and then um, completing quests, I suppose, right? And um, I, I guess like what I'm trying to say is like, this game comprises of so many like, you know, gaming, you know, play styles, and they all implement it well, and it's super clean. Right, like the game did not feel like it was a drag to me. Like honestly, I think the whole entire recording session was somewhere around like that sounds about right, right? It sounds about like about seven, eight hours, right? I believe. Uh and it didn't felt like that long at all, right? I feel like you know and that's always been a good sign, right? It's like if if that just truly means that I'm truly enjoying the game. And look at this like credits, right? Like the credit is super short for for like a team that is this small and compact and able to deliver an experience like that. Absolutely brilliant. I think, right, this game, even if it doesn't win like game of the year, they should at least be nominated for game of the year. Like this is absolutely brilliant. Like this is it. Like 2022, this game is the game, you know, if you're looking for something casual to play, this is it. Uh, do I have anything bad to say about it? Um, no, not really. Like, nothing really stands out to me about that this game is bad or anything like that. Um, I guess the story is a little corny. Like, sometimes uh, some things doesn't make sense to me. Like, for example, if they're robots, shouldn't they have, like, ways to like you know transform their body so then it's not like a humanoid you know body so then maybe shape like a dog or a cat something more nimble so then they can get themselves out uh but of course I i'm really poking trying to poke holes into this game now like there's absolutely nothing wrong with this game i love it the graphics was amazing story amazing gameplay a ton of them, a different variety of styles by that. Uh, that's what I mean. And um, I think it was gelled together very, very well. And with that, that concludes my first time playthrough of Stray. Uh, I might go back to the chapter and explore that uh, one part that I missed inside the game. But you know what, maybe not. I kind of like where I left it off as this. Um, besides, it wasn't anything major, it's just lore, probably story development. But I think I've gotten a good kick of the entire story and everything. Anyhow, with that, uh, thank you so much all for watching. If you do like my videos, please do consider liking this video, subscribe to my channel. I got plenty of other games on my channel. And with that, I'll be seeing you guys around.